morning everybody, what is up? Welcome back to my channel if you're new, my name is Danielle. It is another college week in my life vlog. I took a break for a little bit and then I posted one last week and y'all went crazy. So, we're just gonna do another one. Um, I do enjoy making them, it's fun kind of editing them at the end of the week and being like, oh, this was my week. So, it's Monday right now, 8.48 a.m. I'm about to walk to class, the weather is starting to finally warm up, it just makes me so happy. Um, so, but I have to wear a jacket obviously. Um, I've been listening to Broadway show tunes all morning and drinking tea and it's just, it's gonna be the start of a good week. Layout of this week, I'm headed to econ right now, advertising at 12, 12, 12, 20. And then I'm recording the podcast with Brooke later today, chapter tonight, probably working out, doing some meal prepping actually, so I'll vlog that. This week is pretty chill after midterms. The la last week and this week are pretty chill work-wise, which I'm just so happy about. Um, and then Friday, I head to New York City with Brooke. We're doing a ton of stuff for the podcast. We're doing like a little meet and greet situation that I announced on social media and everything. So hopefully I'm meeting some of you guys there. Um, but yeah, we're just going from Friday to a Sunday. So it's kind of a quick trip, but you guys know I love New York City. So I'm very thankful for the opportunities I get. And yeah, so... Yeah, um, and then we have a date night and my sorority tomorrow night, and then, yeah. So, I'm wearing this really cool top from Free People Movement, and then these leggings are from Lululemon, Vince slip-ons, and then I'm gonna zip up, obviously, but I'm wearing this new jacket I got from Sundry off of Revolve. There's matching sweatpants, too. I'm obsessed. So, yeah, it's like 50-something degrees outside, so I figured this would be good for the day. But, yeah, I'm gonna get my AirPods and then walk to class. It's lunchtime, in between classes, about to do a group project. Hey, what's up? Hello. Back at the apartment, got jazz vibes going, making myself my first coffee of the day. I'm trying not to drink it right away if I don't need it. Like, if I, if I need coffee in the morning, I'm gonna do it. But this morning I was like, chill with some green tea, and now I'm just starting to get tired. So we're gonna make a little iced latte. I haven't used my Nespresso in a minute. I used it yesterday, and then I was like, wow, I forgot how much I love it. Oh baby, that looks good. Just made my latte. Brooke is about to be here and we're recording Gals on the Go. They just got here. <laughs> Cheers. She's got her Chick-fil-A. I've got my Nespresso. Oh yeah. <laughs> the jazz vibes. We're about to have a call for the podcast. We just signed with Podcast One, if you guys didn't know. We're very excited about Very excited. It. Finally got some good stuff happening for the pod. Gals on the business grind. Gals on the business grind. And then we're recording this week's episode. And yeah, everything is dandy. Totally. Um, just so in case, like, I don't know, something happens and you guys can't get in the studio, we're not... Like, All right, we are about to record this week. We're talking about how to get through the rest of the school year because it is a struggle We all know so definitely tune into gals on the go podcast always linked down below in preparation for Coachella and just try to be healthier Delaney and I are sending each other pictures of what we eat or we're just like text should be like eggs and toast this morning I said toast this morning so we like stay accountable So if like you feel crappy about sending food you're like, oh I shouldn't do this again So she sent me her salad good for her at a latte and then I just I'm snacking on a couple of these before spin and I'm like Ugh the worst and she's coming to pick me up for spin now. It's the fit, putting on my sneakers, a jacket, and we're gonna spin, dinner, chapter. Boom. So we just got back from spin and we're parked at KD and it's pouring rain. Should we go in? I don't, I don't know. Comment down below. It was like as soon as we're parking it started raining heavier. Like we I will get soaked. Look at all that pollen. I talked to my dad on the phone today. He thinks it's allergies, but not sure. So if it continues after like taking this medicine, then I'm gonna go to the doctor. But I just went to CVS and got some cough relief because it just sucks when you're literally talking and speaking to someone, you just have to cough. Every time I laugh, I start coughing and I laugh a lot. And then I got a huge bag of Hall's cough, cough drops. And then I just got a smoothie with my friend Becca because she was going and I was like, yeah, let's go. So it's just like a berry smoothie so I'm gonna take a shower hey guys so it's been a minute since I vlogged last night after I got out of the shower this was not feeling well at all took my cough medicine and I started to watch a movie and then I just literally started to fall asleep and did one of those like as you're like falling asleep on the couch walk to bed fall asleep like didn't brush my teeth yikes so gross it was just like I was so tired and 
it was just weird because I woke up this morning and I just was so discombobulated. I like didn't do all my pre, you know, before going to bed routine. But it was like 10.15 and I haven't gone to bed at 10.15 in, I can't tell you the last time. So it was really, really good for me. I got a lot of sleep. My body really needed that. So yeah, it's just been kind of like a weird morning. I wasn't feeling amazing. Um, but now I'm kind of rallying, if you will. It is now um, 2.20. I am so excited. I am working with Revolve. They just came out with a new website called Superdown. Um, and it's, I don't know, it's just kind of like a brand. They sell the brand on Revolve, but then they also have a website for it. And they sent me this shirt and these really cute jeans I'm wearing right now. Um, and I'm so excited. So Callie's coming over on her way to class just very briefly to take a photo for me. And then I'm gonna get some schoolwork done and possibly go work out, but I don't really know if that's the best for me. I just really want to. Yeah, that's kind of the layout. It's Tuesday. Tuesdays are chill because I only have one class. Um, I have a, I have to upload a video. I don't know, I'm in a weird mood, can you tell? So I'm just drinking some coffee, my first coffee of the day, don't worry. Guys, I'm dead. My mom, if you listen to the podcast, I talked about how my mom entered our, like, a family recipe to the UGA dining services, because on Thursday they're doing, like, a taste of home thing where parents submit recipes and the dining hall might pick it. So my mom's recipe got chosen. The sausage, egg, and cheese casserole, and it says a favorite of Danielle and Carolyn. I am dead. So that's going to be featured for breakfast at the dining hall, at one of the Snelling dining hall. We have a few. Um this thursday so my friends and i are gonna go i'm just so excited this is so funny to me like all these recipes got chosen and this the one for this dining hall so i have to make sure to get there before breakfast ends on thursday finally getting to do my dishes glorious all right guys i have to do this super quick because he's downstairs but i'm going to dinner with my boyfriend wow weird to say that um all right yeah i'm gonna see you guys tomorrow going to dinner yeah. <laughs> Hi guys, it is Wednesday morning. I've got class and then my advertising class isn't a thing today. Instead, we're supposed to meet with our groups to do our group project. So that is what we're going to do. Um, it's a beautiful day outside. It's like 50 degrees, but like it's sunny and beautiful. And like I woke up and I heard the birds chirping and it just put me in the best mood. I'm breaking out like crazy right now. Love that. But I don't feel like putting on makeup right now. I might later. This is my outfit. I'm obsessed. I just got this sweatshirt at Urban Outfitters this weekend. I am obsessed with it. It's so comfy. It's champion, but it's like... I don't know, unique and mustard. And then we're in Lululemon leggings, fin slip-ons. I'm going to pop in my AirPods and listen to some music and walk to campus. But yeah, I'm sorry that I didn't vlog a lot yesterday. I wasn't feeling well and then I kind of bounced back and then I got in grind mode and I just sat right there and did a ton of work. I'm gonna try and vlog a lot more today. Um, but better a vlog than nothing, right? Oh, I look so bad. <laughs> Trying a matcha green tea lemonade. Mm. All right, guys, I'm in a good mood. I, I swear, weather changes moods. Like, it is sunny out, it's beautiful. I'm just in a good mood. I'm in the mood to like do good for my body. That matcha green tea lemonade is just getting me in a good mood, I guess. Life hack sometimes something I do when I know I want to work out later, but I might not be motivated later, is when I get dressed for the day, I put on workout clothes so that I can't like make an excuse of, oh, I have to change, like whatever. Like I wore this to class today. I wore like a hoodie over it, obviously. I just had to change into some sneakers. I'm just gonna go to the gym in my apartment building and just do, I'm kind of more, I've been doing a lot of cardio at Orange Theory and everything, but I'm kind of wanting to do some more like weights and stuff, like some arm stuff, like squats and just like very simple stuff because I need to take a shower. So I'm like, why don't I just get a little sweat sesh in before I take a shower? All right, laundry's folded. The new batch is drying now. <sighs> Guys, 
this is just, this is ridiculous. The weather is now starting to warm up, aka all these sweaters don't need to be here. So I just constantly, I'm very thankful I get new clothes all the time and I'm, you know, I'm always bringing stuff in. So as my mom always says, when you bring stuff in, you need to, you know, take stuff out as well. I'm gonna go through my sweaters, put some away, put some to give away and just kind of detox my closet just a little bit. All right guys, a little update. We've got all my sweaters that I wanna put away and I don't know where, I don't know what I'm doing with them, but I have storage somewhere. Looking a lot better. I have to, those sweatshirts get so like messy so easily. But I finally closed these two drawers. These are my sweatshirts, these are my shirts. This drawer I refold like once a month and then like when I'm getting ready to go somewhere like I just throw everything everywhere. I kept a couple sweaters in the back so it's not super warm yet. And then I just kind of boomed everything up that was back there for like springtime. And I have stuff um, over here, some recent things I purchased that I haven't hung up yet because I didn't have room and now I do. I'll like, I usually put some of my favorite items right here. Da 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 da. That looks so much better. That we're just gonna ignore, but like, come on. Legit just filmed a video. I filmed a Q&A and I talked about um, my new major and my boyfriend. So you guys should definitely go watch that. That'll be up before this video. Go watch that if you haven't yet. But um, I'm just in, I'm in a very like chill outfit. Um, I'm gonna change and then my, I don't know who, but one of my friends is gonna come get me and we're all gonna do a homemade dinner like I said before. I think we're going to the blind pig. It's like our tradition. It's so not healthy. It's it's just they have really good food. Oh, do I want a grilled cheese? Do I want chicken nuggets? Or should I get a Caesar salad with like a side of something? Thoughts. We are pigging out tonight at Blind Pig. Look, it's so homemade. This is so exciting. <laughs> we have lots of yummy food up in here. All right, Honestly. yay, back to eating. We're going to see Five Feet Apart. We're see a last minute spontaneous decision. <laughs> Love that. This is a cool movie theater. Over and your, I looked over and your hood was up. And My I was hood like, was up. I was like, I, oh, I started laughing. I was like, Daily, please look at Danielle right now. I, guys, that movie just took me so it, many different emotions. It wrecked me. I was wrecked like, me. you can't do this. Like, at one point, I was like, you're stressing. We were all stressed out at one scene. I, did any, I was like, no, no, no. That was the second time I saw it, and it was still yes. Yeah, she as saw good. it twice already. Just as good, like it was amazing. It's definitely a tear jerker. If you haven't seen it, ten out of ten. But also, if you want to cry. Also, it was just so cute, and like makes me want to hug everyone. I can touch you all. I love you guys. I know. Honestly, also, it makes me so happy that they made a movie about CF because I feel like there needs to be more. Bring more everyone awareness needs to, be aware to CF. A hundred percent. Now I have like so much more awareness it about it. Hey guys, so it's midnight now. I have got to go to bed. Um, but yeah, last minute, well, we went to dinner, it was really, really fun, and then we spontaneously decided we wanted to go see Five Feet Apart tonight. I've been wanting to see it since it came out, since I saw the trailers, and so we just went and saw it, and it was, the movie theater was really nice that we went to. It was like, you could like recline your chairs and stuff. Um, it's really, really sad. Me and my friends literally like were the whole, like, I mean, I think other people will cry, but like the ma the majority of the tears and the the noises were coming from our region. Um, the movie was really, really, really good. I knew I was gonna cry. I didn't know I was gonna cry as hard as I did. It was amazing though. But I've got to go to bed because in the morning I'm gonna go to Snelling Dining Hall and see my mom's casserole being served. So I'm really excited about that. And then I have class. And then I gotta pack. Tomorrow's a busy day because we're prepping for New York City. So. I'm gonna go to bed, I'm exhausted. Good morning guys, it is Thursday morning. I'm just sipping on some coffee, I'm a little sleepy. It's 9.25, I'm about to head over to Snelling Dining Hall, and it works out because it's right next to the class I have, right after that. So yeah, I'm gonna head over now, I'm excited. I swear if it's out, because breakfast ends at 10.30 at all the dining halls, that's why I'm getting there at 9.45, because I just want to make sure there's some left, you know? Thank you so much. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. I will. It is so beautiful outside right now. I had to take a break to just sit by the fountain. I love this fountain so much. It's just so nice out. 
Woo, just made it back from class and the dining hall. Guys, the people at Snelling were literally like, oh my gosh, like it's yours. Like, oh my gosh, you have to get your commemorative plate. Like they were also sweet. Like I met the head chef and it was just like a time. It was so funny. Like they were just like, wow, that's so sweet. You actually came. I'm like, yeah, like my mom's casserole was featured and it was cool. Cause like, they were like, we can't keep the casserole out. Like everyone keeps coming to get it. Like they have to keep refilling it. And I was like, that makes me so happy. And I FaceTimed my mom and she was just freaking out and it really tasted just as good it was exciting because usually my mom only makes it on Christmas so I got it twice this year it is so hot right now oh my god I just decided to walk back from class instead of taking the bus and I do that a lot but from the class that I came from it's extra extra far so I'm really proud of myself so that was definitely my workout for the day um, so yeah I'm in the best mood because it is just so beautiful out like I know I've been saying that all week but seriously it's been so rainy and cold here and it really does affect your mood and now that it's sunny out it just puts me in the best mood like halfway on my walk I had to take my sweatshirt off because I was like sweating one thing of homework I need to get done but really not much game plan for the rest of the day um, I still don't have my car. I think my car is gonna be done tomorrow, so I'm not gonna get it till Monday since I'm going out of town tomorrow. I am going to Uber over to Katie and Delaney's letting me borrow her car um, to run some errands. So I'm gonna go get a spray tan for New York because we're taking a lot of photos and stuff. So I'm gonna go do that at Crunch. I'm gonna go to Party City, I think, or somewhere to get a cowgirl hat because tonight we have a social thing where you wear, um, it's like Wild West themed. So I wanna get a cowgirl hat because I already have cowgirl boots. So I wanna do that um, and anything else I need to get done. I also wanna film my March favorites video um, just because I wanna have some videos ready for you guys because I don't like when I don't have videos that I can just post. Stopped oh, by Cap Dizzler. I got the keys, baby. Be careful now. <laughs> okay, dad. <laughs> All right, Delaney is trusting me with her car. Thank you, Delaney. Gosh, she has such longer legs than me. I have to like adjust. All right, got my spray tan. And I think they accidentally did like the bronze instead of clear. Usually I get clear so you can't like see it until you like shower and like it develops. And I just like it because it doesn't stain things. And I'm pretty sure she gave me a little bronze. Honestly, I look better, but I just feel so sticky now. All right, found myself a hat. All right, I am filling Delaney's car up now because she's an angel for letting me use this and I know gas is annoying. Got cowboy hats and got some dinner. I haven't had lunch today, but I'm like not hungry. I went to Walks Up. It's like you make your own stir fry. All right, I'm back. I'm watching the Kardashians and I'm outfit planning for this weekend. I'm going for business chic vibes, as you can tell. Got all my blazers and my more professional looking things. I'm packed completely for New York, so I'm just gonna go to this for a little bit and then come home and go to bed, cause I have to wake up at 5.30 in the morning, but I'm really excited about all the outfits I have packed and everything for New York. I'm so excited and don't worry, there's going to be a New York weekend in my life per usual. Yeah, I'll show you guys my outfit really quick and then I'm gonna end the vlog. So this is my hat from today. I wish I got a better one but this was just the best I could do. Um, I'm wearing this black bodysuit from Princess Polly. Jeans, shorts are from a gold day off of Revolve. A lot of you guys have asked me about that. Then I'm wearing this bandana around my neck. I believe I got it from Garage. And then I'm finally getting to wear these boots. They're from Rebecca Minkoff. I love them so much. And they just go great with the outfit. I'm excited about them. Thank you guys so much for watching yet again another week in my life. I love you guys so much. If you like this video, make sure to give it a like if you want. I never asked to do that. And subscribe because I post new videos every Wednesday and Sunday. So I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.